EGN, hit that like button. Yeah, hit the like button. Hit that like button like it's a cancer patient in your pistol packing, <laughs> producer Joe. Pistol packing, producer Joe. I like that. Pistol packing, producer Joe. Yeah, and then wait. I, I know you don't have to get you don't want to get involved with this, but the guy was seventy seven. His his neighbor was seventy seven. So I heard Joe's story on that and he hit him with a baseball bat but then i also saw the police report said nothing about a baseball bat so i'm confused by that whole thing but i will say when joe was on the bs show because i went i was on that episode and uh so that friday morning joe's explaining himself for that video of him in like the uh, medical center and he was being this like white knight, like, well, if my wife wants something, i'm going to give it to her and you know she wanted a snack and i was going to give her that and it's like all right Relax there, buddy. We get it. You love your wife. That's fine. It's neither here nor there, though. It doesn't matter. Yeah, that's not why they were mad. At, they they weren't mad because he was buying a, his wife a snack because he was like being loud in the fucking waiting room, right? Yeah, I think I think they were getting annoyed with him. But he was saying that someone yelled at him for grabbing multiple snacks, and they said it's just for the patients, and he was just there waiting for his wife. It's like a six hour treatment. But yeah, I, I think he was just probably annoying the shit out of everyone. I think really him and Chad, they they were made made for each other. They were mad that I was I took too many snacks. I mean, I don't think so. That's not <laughs> the video. That's not the video story. I saw. He was he was having a fucking conversation on his on his computer. And he was t- it's annoying. It's annoying to everybody, especially if you're if you're waiting at a cancer center and someone's yeah. fucking blah blah blah. I get to know when people talk that loud uh, outside when they're walking down the street, just yelling, talking loud. I'm like, for, you know, it's just annoying to me. Anyway, so if I was in a cancer fucking center and a guy was like having a conversation, like he was the only guy there, I'd be annoyed too, even if I didn't have cancer. <laughs> Good point. 